In this tutorial, we'll go over how to create a class in Prodigy and then what Prodigy looks like to a student as they play. So you'll learn how to log into Prodigy as a teacher and create your class and then how students can access the Prodigy within that class. So this is what Prodigy looks like when you open it and it's www.prodigygame.com. As a teacher, all you need to do is go to log in and then log in with Google. So you'll log into your K-12 North Star account and then it opens up to your classes page. So as you can see, I already have a class, but if I want to make another one, all I do is press plus and then you name it, select the grade, and you can even import a class from Google Classroom. Okay, so now that you've created your new class, press view class and now add students and you can have ones that already had accounts or ones that haven't. Press my students will create their own accounts. And then all they need to do when they log in is add that class code. Press continue and then you can print out this PDF or write it up on a board or something for your students to see. So now that you've created your class and you've decided that they're going to take a placement test to see what their level is at, let's see what a student does to get into the class. So students press on Play Prodigy. Press New Student. First. So you put in the class code. Press Next. Put your first and your last name. Press Next. You need a password for your account. Remember to enter it twice. Great are you in? Here's your login information. So once you have your username and password, tell your students to write it somewhere that they'll remember or make them open a Google Doc and write their passwords there. Because this is how they're going to get into their account. So you press next. Then it prompts the students to log in and will give them their information. And press login. What does your wizard look like? And now they get to choose if they're character, what it's going to look like. Are you playing from school? And then press play. And this is what the actual gameplay looks like. Looks like it wants to... So in this you get a battle monsters and go on quest. And while you do so, you do solve math problems, but in a fun and engaging manner. So students actually like solving the problems because it helps them defeat characters and move on in the quest. So you press that, and so now I choose the correct answer and press cast spell. And then when you get it correct, then you do damage to the other character. And so you work through the missions like this, solving problems and moving forward. But you can also do things like algebra, multiplication, all sorts of math. So you choose the level that your students work on and as they go through it will change based on what they get correct and what they get wrong. So overall this is how you play. Prodigy. It's a fun engaging way to learn math for students.